بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم فرینڈز اینڈ سبسکرائبرز دس از محمد شیخ اینڈ فرام پاسٹ ویڈیوز آئی ایم ورکنگ آن اے ٹیوٹوریل سیریز اف میکنگ اے بلاگ بلاگ ایپلیکیشن یوزنگ لیرول 5.4 اینڈ ان مائی لاسٹ ویڈیو آئی ہیو کمپلیٹڈ دی فنکشنلٹی اف کرڈ دیٹ از ڈیلیٹنگ ڈیلیٹنگ اے پارٹیکولر پوسٹ اینڈ ان دس ویڈیو آئی ول بی ورکنگ آن پیجنیشن اینڈ اینڈ آئی ول کمپلیٹ دس شوئنگ Uh, all the posts that are related to any specific categories okay so if i click on the any of the category here that is say technology then i'll be i'll be displaying all the posts that are available inside the technology category okay so i will do that in this video so let's start with the pagination okay so the, now let's go to our home page and here in this home page i want to display pagination okay i have added 10 posts here and i want to display five page five posts per page okay so i'll do i'll just uh, go to my home controller okay so home controller is responsible for uh, displaying this view and here i have uh, taken the I have, i'm fetching all the posts that's why it's displaying all 10 posts on my home page instead of that what i'll do i'll just change it to paginate okay page in it and i will pass value as 5 okay now let's see refresh the page and now let's see how many posts uh, are there in home page 1 2 3 4 and 5 okay since we have you know, restricted uh, to fetch only 5 posts from the database that's why it is playing 5 page okay 5 posts okay so now let's come back to our editor and let's go to our home dot blade dot php okay go to go to resources inside resources click on views and then click on home dot blade dot php and here and inside this row okay i want to um, i want to use a link okay and link will be dollar post of of links okay now let's refresh save the page and refresh okay now you can see links are displaying since i have 10 records and i have divided all my 10 records into two pages that's why per page i am getting five records five uh, posts now if i click on this second link then you can see the link is changed and a question mark page equals to id which is this is the id of the page which is the second page okay now the rest of the posts are displaying on my second page okay? now if i go back if i can move between these pages using these two these two uh, arrow marks also okay? Okay, now in my first page okay so this is how we can uh, create pagination okay now let's uh, move on displaying displaying all the posts that are belong to specific category so for that let's go to our home page home.blade.html here you can see uh, let's go we are not on home we need to go to this view page okay where we have displayed these categories okay display all these categories are inside view blade.php okay inside posts we have a file called as view.blade.php and here we are having a uh, all the categories okay so i have attached id as a link to this category so that when i place a cursor on this uh, uh, mouse you can see here at the bottom left side here you will we can see the id of that particular category okay, sports are sports is having a category 1 entertainment is having category 2 bollywood 3 politics 4 then travel 5 and then ocean 6 technology 7 and then science 8 Okay, so now what I will do is, uh, so whenever user clicks on this uh, any of the link, I want to uh, redirect. I want to send a get request to a category. I want to send a request to here. Okay, inside my post controller. Okay, I want to send a request in my web.php file. I'll just write route colon 
get and then slash category slash id okay and then i will call this post controller copy this and paste here and inside that i will create a function as category okay so whenever user clicks on this link which is uh, the name of the category which is here if the user clicks on any of the category a request a get request will be sent and the uh, uh, function which has been uh, declared defined here uh, which is category which is present which i am going to create inside this post controller will get called okay we are and to create a function with a name called as category okay and here i will receive that category id category id and i will return this id dollar category id okay now let's refresh the page and if i click on this entertainment then i will get the id of that entertainment category now if i click on technology i will get the id of this you know, technology category okay so now i will i will create a view okay now i will create a view inside categories as a new file so it has categories posts okay dot blade dot php okay now i will copy the same layout which i have done for i have created for this uh, view just copy this code entire code of this view dot blade blade dot php and i will paste it here and comes here and i will call this category categories dot categories post dot okay only this much okay and i will okay since our category view or this uh, page uh, is displaying these categories which are coming from the databases and we need to send these database results to our new view which is which we have created categories post so for that i need to call categories equals to category all okay i will uh, fetch i am fetching all the categories from my category table copy this and pass it to the pass this to our view copy paste it here okay now let's refresh and now if i click on this entertainment i am getting error So let's just uh, go to our this view and delete everything from this view. Okay, now save it and refresh. Okay, now I'm getting the tables, but I want now I got the categories, but I want to display the categories. Uh, sorry, display the posts of all of. Uh, all post of that specific category to okay, let's go to block and if i click on this view and from here if i want to view each and every post that are present inside this category i can click on just click on this okay suppose i want to view the post of politics those uh, all the posts related to politics will start displaying here okay so for that come here okay and inside this post controller we need to write a query dollar post equals to db table and you need to pass the first uh, name of your first table okay here i need to join two tables first is post table and the second one is categories table because i need to display all the posts that belongs to this category okay so we need to join post table with the categories table 
here you can see I have taken the keys foreign keys I have a category ID here I will just show you first this table post table inside post table I have taken the field as category ID where I am storing uh, the category ID of post okay which tells me that this particular post belongs to this particular category okay so I with the help of this category field category ID field I can uh, join these two tables and get the uh, desired posts okay so now I'll uh, okay I have taken first table and now I'll join it with uh, join it with uh, our categories table okay and where okay let's go to our here uh, search for uh, search for laravel table join and then click on the first link and you will get an option called as joins click on it and here you will get the necessary uh, statement of uh, statements or uh, command that are used to join two tables i'll just copy this and i'll come here and i'll just post it here I will paste it here and I will change it to posts. Okay, I will change it. First table is post. I want to join post table with my categories table and I want to join okay. I want to join category ID of post table. Okay, as you have already seen, I have a field with the name called as category ID inside my post table. I want to join uh, post table with category table by using this category ID. Okay, now post dot category ID is equals to categories dot ID. Okay, and I want to join only these two tables, and I want to select everything from the post table and everything from the categories table okay now let's return this let's see what uh, data or uh, information this query is going to return to us let's return dollar post and then exit okay now save it and now come here to our project and then refresh Okay, now let's click on this technology category. Okay, this could not found unknown column categories not categories. Let's see. Okay, it should be star everything. Now let's refresh the page again. Okay, I'm getting all the posts, but uh, see here, here you can see I have 10 posts in my database and it's returning all the posts all those 10 posts but I want only those posts which belongs to category 7 which is technology for that we need to use a where condition here where posts dot categories dot id is equals to this id category id okay i am taking the id uh, from the request and i am uh, matching based on the category id here okay now i will get only those records which which are comes under category 7 now refresh you can see i got only that much records which belongs to category 7 now i can pass this data to my view okay so this is how we, you can debug your queries you can see whether your queries are working fine or not whether this query is returning any data or not so now what i will do i will just send this data inside the array to my view copy and paste here okay now let's come to our categories posts okay, now let's undo okay i don't want this ul here 
okay you might um, you might remember that i had deleted the, all this uh, code just few minutes back now we just press control uh, z to reverse that undo process uh, i'll just undo it and uh, bring the previous code back okay, so now from here i will just delete this Okay. and also I had copied this complete code from my uh, view dot and now you know let's go and refresh the page yes now you can see I am getting posts of only uh, technology category if I click on entertainment I will get the post of only entertainment category and now if I click on sports I will get only Post, post of only sports category you now if i click on science i will get the post of that belongs to only you know, science category okay so this is how we can uh, we can uh, you display pagination to our posts and also we can filter our data based on some id or based on some categories okay so if i click on this technology i will get all the records from technology okay so i hope you like this video i hope you get some useful information out of this video and i was uh, i just uh, recommend you guys to watch this complete tutorial series and if you watch this complete tutorial series you will be you will be learning a lot if you if you are coming in the middle and if you are trying to watch any um, any video any individual video uh, from this tutorial from this series then it will be very much uh, difficult for you guys to understand because uh, if you keep track uh, all the videos if you have seen the, from the beginning itself then it will be very much easier for you to understand what is going on here and um, and uh, you can learn a lot from this video series okay so if you like this video then subscribe to our channel click on like button and share it with your friends and i will see you guys in my next video and thanks for watching